Hi right, guys, so today I want to show you how to create CRUD methods to interact with RESTDB. RESTDB is a hosted database service that I recently discovered. Um, I'm starting at this point because the sign-up process is pretty straightforward. If you have a Facebook or Gmail account, you can create an account within a few seconds. They offer both a free and paid service, so technically there's no reason not to at least give them a try. Okay, so let me show you what my dashboard looks like. Um, as you can see, I have a database called My Contacts. I have a collection called Friends. And within, within this collection, I have three fields. First name, last name, and title. Now, like I mentioned, I'm going to be focused on the CRUD methods. And CRUD stands for Create, Read, or Slash, Retrieve, Update, and Delete. Um, and I'm, I'm going to start with the Read method first. So I'm going to pre-populate my collection with uh, some data. Because me and Bobby Brown are friends. Um, he's a singer. Yeah, that take okay and let me add one more let's say even though he's not a programmer anymore well he might be okay so let's start coding this out so wrap this in a class And I always add this force of habit. Okay. And see, it has an API docs. And since we're using curl, I'm just going to focus on this particular section here. So I don't have to keep on flipping back and forth. I just copy and paste it. This curl example. All right, so let's write our first method. And we say we're going to be the read, which is select. And we're using curl. All right, so let's copy and paste our API URL down here. Get rid of this. Um, all right, we have some headers we need to pass. So we can say curl set. Opt. Uh, so it's probably curl opt underscore. And we're looking for a header. HTTP. Okay. And we need to throw on a ray edit. Basically, just copy this and paste it. this method all right so this is what we got 
with the API URL, passing the header with the API key. According to this documentation, that should be always needed. So let's see what we have. Boom. And then JSON, so let's convert it to an array. In fact, let's just return it. Let's run this. Boom. Okay. So this is our read. And so let's do this down. Because it's going to be our create. And what do we need to do to insert documents? Post. Um, okay, so it looks like we're going to post method. I mean, use curl. To send a post method. All right, so you know what? Let's copy some of this over instead of rewriting everything. Um, and post. So the post. Set option again. We need to post fields. Um, CPO. That's it. And these fields need to be in JSON. Um, so let's just say JSON and code, right? Um, post bars. It's going to be an array we're going to throw at it. So I'm just going to place this at the top array. And we need to satisfy three fields. So first name, another friend of mine is Tony. Last name. Yep, Tony Hop. Uh oh. Give it a title. What is he, a skater? Let's just say he's a pro skater. Um. Alright, so. Do a custom what is it? custom request, I think it's called curl top boom. Because we're going to be posting. So this works is 
gonna return comment select out all right cross finger here we go boom so let's run the select one more time then Okay. Crud. Create update. So we need to update. Um, how do you update a record? Right, let's take this. Get rid of this now. almost like a post so let's just copy this Just to put, and that should. Oh, all right. We need to throw an object ID at it. So this should work. Our update, we should be changing skater. Wait a minute. What was it? We can just change it to Alright, let's run it. Last one is delete. So this is very similar to our put in post, so I'm just going to copy this down and we can throw object ID at it. We don't need this.
put the delete and we don't need this and that should be it for delete right comment this stuff out So we're deleting Yeah, we're deleting Tony Hawk. Boom. Okay, so this wraps up our CRUD method project where we show you how to interact with RESTDB using um, curl and PHP. Um, wait a minute. Yeah, so basically we're at around 17 minutes. I'm going to cut this video short here, but I'm going to update the code and place it on my GitHub. And feel free to, you know, smash it up, cut it up, do what you need to do to make it work for you. Um, but I am going to make some modifications to it before I upload to GitHub. Okay, guys. Uh, thanks. Talk to you later.